Okay then, we're just loading in again for the iRacing Grand Prix Tour at the circuit Gilles Villeneuve. There's a possibility you might miss the start on this because the game, uh, when it went over to qualifying, it, it, nothing would happen for me. It wouldn't allow me to run qualifying. Not that I wanted to qualify anyway, I wanted to start at the back. Uh, so I shut it down. Tried to get back in, but it was says or restarting. Did that like three times, saying, and it said it game was already running when it wasn't. When the task manager closed the game down because it actually was still running, and now I've closed the UI and gone back in. So hopefully we get loaded in before the race starts. Uh, I imagine it probably starts about fourteen minutes. I mean, I don't. Einstein from the pits, <laughs> as long as we're not too far behind. Uh, this time we just, I mean, I'm feeling terrible today. Uh, just really tired. I don't know what's wrong with me. Uh, got a doctor's appointment in a few weeks' time. Uh, it could possibly be long COVID. I'm still not, yeah, it's not, still not feel right since I had it. Ah. Good, right. Okay, so we are car 17. We are starting 23rd. That's perfect. Let's grid up. We'll be disqualified if we don't change the tyre compounds before the race is over. You'll have to stop for more fuel before the race is over. Right, okay. Can you hear me? It looks like you can hear me. You can see all that. Uh, there's a lot of people not starting around us, hopefully. 30 seconds. Phew, made it. Beginning to panic, then I was thinking there was something wrong with the game. Uh, yeah, so it actually, a ginormous split with 26 cars in this split. Rank 17. I mean, my rating has taken a right trashing this week, <laughs> so I've lost 200 on about 200 in the I rating. Uh, let's get session best lap up. And um, we're going to take the medium and see how far we can go. And we're just going to take it really easy on this first lap. I'm not even going to bother to start properly. Green flag, green flag. That first first corner can cause all sorts of problems. And as we know from the first attempt. you got a toy car on the right. Go left. First attempt, the hairpin is the one that we're going to have to look out for. You got a slow car on the left. Already. Slow car ahead. Might be just someone trying to get back. Get to the back. You got a slow car on the left. You got a slow car on the right. Go left. Go right. Left side. Still there. Well, let him have it. He's obviously clearly wanting it. And the car we start next to has gone straight on. Again, in practice, there's still loads of people crashing. I don't know how so many cars behind me. Maybe they're all the ones that started the pits. Feel a bit more confident that we can now go. After this car is a big gap to those ahead. One minute I think if we just finish, we probably make it top 10. Don't know why I'm in second. There's a big gap behind us already. There are a few people in this race that we've raced before. I think some of them uh, it was actually in the IndyCar series we raced. Uh, 
and I saw Nibon 5 did the short race, he managed to take a soft 17 laps. Uh, well, that's a bit... Probably, uh... Taking it too easy there. So I think we could confidently take him about 20 laps. At the end of the race, maybe a bit more if others, the leaders are coming and doing the same. That's not good. good. Not good news for the leader. Something's happened uh, because the one car that was ahead of us is now a pack of three or four. By the looks of it. Not getting that right. Yeah, it's having four cars ahead of us battling. I don't want to get too close to them. I saw a car off somewhere. Not got DRS there. Well, we're on the grass, it's not a good idea. Left side. Keep to the right. Still there. Stay on the right. Clear. Car right. Keep to the left. Clear on the right. I'm just going to let him have it. I'm not feeling at all confident at all after what happened in the first race. And how I'm feeling physically. It's a long way to go, and these people can easily wreck out. And I could easily wreck out as well, but. I'm not wanting to race at this point. We could end up like that car here, there. So this is the Saturday evening, Saturday, Sunday evening slot. The race actually might be going on at some point during, during this race, the actual Formula One race. So that's why I was surprised to see so many here. But maybe they have to watch you on catch up like I do. I've already lost to DRS. My head is so foggy at the moment. Uh, yeah, so a surprise. There was about. I was over 40, signed up. Probably more, fifth, like 50, we're probably in two splits of 26, I guess. Uh, but I do find in this slot. The drivers are a bit better normally than the top split. Nice, right, another one gone. But uh, Formula 1 qualifying, I'm so happy to see Alonso on the front row of the grid. I hope he does something in the race, I really do. I'd love to see him win. I don't think he will. I think it would be Max. Uh, but we'll have to see. So our lap times are in the 16s. Well, the last lap was 16. 16s are good, I think, for me. 
think on this sort of... I can't remember, we could have fired uh, on our first attempt. I think we might have qualified in the 15s. So 21 is closing on in on us. Pass on the next straight. Clear. He's on the hards. Uh, I've seen a whole multitude of different tyre. Uh, there's another gaggle up here. Different tyre options. I think last right, yes, I was really actually contemplating on a strategy to do two stops. Uh, mediums, mediums and softs for a stint. Uh, but someone did say in the chat, one stop. just awkward. You see it so many on times on TV and don't think anything of it, but to drive it myself, just find it very awkward. And this one as well. You have to I'm having to seriously underdrive it. Just realise I'm in intact mode, which is not great. Shows how observant I am. Hopefully balanced will deploy the energy a lot better. Right, 26 is catching us. But not many people have crashed out yet. Uh, track temperature 41 degrees that was just the same as our first attempt also about the same as when I practice I don't know how track rubbering affects this uh, affects tire wear But in my practice, as I think I said in my first attempt, those softs, I found the softs wore off very quickly. Maybe, maybe driving style has a big effect on this track with uh, a lot of slow corners. I think the 12 might be stuck behind the 21, I don't know. Thank you for spinning in front of me. That's a lockup I didn't need. But at least we survived to tell that one. I think a 26 has spun a couple of times. I'm 
Now there's a possibility I could be the slowest car here. There's It's also a strong possibility the leaders aren't too far off. But that's alright, that's fine. If I get a full race and I'm last, I don't mind. Was much better in the hairpin. Had a load of time there somewhat now. I'm gonna start to knuckle down now. Let's see if we can actually catch that 12. Okay, so 19 was in the pits, but I think he was behind us anyway. Ah, I've shot that. But Delta's still good though. So an accident's happened. Well, and the leader's on our relative. He was like 5.4k driver. Uh, the one car, I think it was a 6k driver, but maybe he's out. Oh, he was starting um, at the, well, didn't qualify. He's coming through the field. One minute, 16.307. Oh, that was the first time I felt a bit of wheel slip there. It's only that 14. Still a long way to go. That wasn't very 
very good. We're not catching the 12 anymore. So I think the 15, I think Steve, we've, uh, we have, uh, raced against before. That must have been a repair that was needed. That looked like the one was in the pits. Up there, I'm losing a lot of time in the hairpin. Need to do better. Actually, in 16th place, it's not bad. Yeah, the one is in the pits. all that time I gained. Baku Grand Prix was an okay watch on TV. It's nice to actually, I think we had three different leaders, didn't we, in the whole race. So it's nice that. But, you know, Ferrari are going to lose this championship because of their reliability. Although Red Bull seem to have got their act together pretty quickly. Uh, but... You know, Red Bull are quite experienced team for fighting up the front. Ferrari haven't done that for many years, so I just wonder if they're... They just lack that instinct. One minute, 15.6, Right, we see if we can let him pass on the back straight. It's my favourite place to let people pass now. losing a lot of time in that chicane. He's already a second ahead of us.
Ah, that was bad. Oh well. I mean, this, uh, this car is a joy and difficult, easy and difficult to drive at the same time. There's so many things that make driving easy. But the sheer speed that you're going, you need to be really good. And I'm, I'm not like that. One minute, 16.995. I do wonder if I was maybe on a bit better equipment rather than just a G27. How much I could improve. for now. G27 is all I got, so that's what we have to make do with. So second place of three is gaining in on us. Ah, 16 is in the pits from 14th place. Now that could actually be a uh, planned stop, well not maybe planned, but some people on softs may find them too worrying at this stage. Yay, you got DRS. Such an early activation point for DRS. But I guess you probably lose the closeness you have in the hairpin. Looks like the 16 was still in the pit, so that was uh, a crash. So second place is on softs. The leader is on mediums, like we are. Do wonder if we can catch the 12 at some point in this race. He has got quite a big gap at the moment though. I didn't actually do much practice today. My thinking was, uh, you know, I gave a load of practice the other day, ready for the first attempt. I didn't want to do that again, just to crash out on that one again. Uh, I probably should have practiced a pit stop. 
the pit entry. Oh, what is going wrong at this hairpin? Just not getting it stopped. Uh, but it's quite, it is an easy pit entry. You can, uh, I can't remember what the speed is that we got to go down to. I think it's about 88 or something. 88 kilometers an hour. Ah, uh, 26 is in the pits. That he must have had. And Steve has disconnected. So something's happened. So we were contending with the 26. So he's had an instance that that. So it's now the six behind us. Well, if he's rank six, he must be quick. It's up to 15th. So I think it is just simply bring it home, and we might might just get a top 10, or as has been the case in other races, 11th. Uh, I have to apologise that there's not been as much content on the channel suite. Nothing's really taken the fancy apart from doing this. I mean, I did try and do a GT4 race, which went completely wrong. I didn't feel that was good enough to post. Although, knowing me, I just feel like, as I recorded and put the F in, I just want to put it up anyway and want to save every moment. Because I'm such a hoarder. One minute, sixteen point five eight four. This is a good track, though. I mean, I got affiliation with this track from like way back when I used to play Formula One games on the old PlayStation. Yes, the. <laughs> The original PlayStation and PlayStation 2 as well. Uh, giving away my age there. And that this was always a good track to drive in those games. Uh, not too difficult to learn either. Uh, I came off the brake and I shouldn't have done that. But at least we got it stopped. Now is this me not concentrating and losing a second or is the tyres starting to go off? I don't know, we just, we're going green now on the Delta so I don't think it's the tyres, it's me talking too much. One minute, Didn't like it there. Someone else was in the pits there. I don't know if it's someone. Oh, there's a guy in 12th place, so someone else has gone. Six has gained a little bit. Under drove that one that time. Thirteen and Yeah, I think that was a guy we saw last up in the pits. Or was it? Or did we see the eleven? I don't know. One minute sixteen point one zero eight. Take a tear off. One of the things I have probably found most difficult getting used to this car is the gearing, having eight gears, and being need to be so quick on the gear shifts. I've never done F3 in I racing. Maybe that would have been better preparation than. 
so many other cars I have. I was fancying maybe doing a bit of uh, Formula Renault 2.0. I bought that car like when it originally came out in iRacing quite a few years ago. And I've only ever done the odd race in it. Uh, so fancy maybe doing that. I think they do when they... When Formula 1 is at the circuit like it is this week. The circuit that iRacing's got. I think they do actually uh, go to that circuit. So... I don't know. Let me know. Would you be interested in seeing me do a Renault 2.0 race and then the Formula 1 full length race in the same week, the same circuit? I was deba debating. Uh, I think that might be good practice for me. But then I thought it might be a bit boring for everyone else to watch to be at the same circuit twice. I'll take your feedback on board. Okay, so 13, he's a new car, he's just out of the pits, so we'll let him pass. He's gone to Sauce. Do you think he can take Sauce all the way? Let's let him pass. We could have battled with him, but he's on fresh softs, and I don't see what the needed media importance is. I do like his livery, though. Let's pick some nice colours here. Uh, I'm not too happy with my livery. Oh, he's so much quicker through that section there. I wonder if he's going for a two-stop. Quite a long way to take the softs. But maybe not. So, plans for the channel coming up. I'm going to put. I know this goes back to me apologising for not doing many races this week. I mean, I am suffering health wise quite a bit at the moment, so. I might not feel like doing as many races as before. And it is summer as well, it's a lot warmer. Oh well, that's my excuse. There you go. He's two seconds quicker that lap. So, I don't know how much, how much of that is the tyres. So may do less races. I also am starting to sort of work on trying to do better thumbnails as well, and that may take up some time that I would normally race. All right, so we're going to be lapped by some more cars. It looks like next. There's no one for ages who we're racing behind us. Looks like. Everyone is really spread out on the uh, flat map. And the other thing I was contemplating is uh, I've got quite excited and saw uh, many others get quite excited about the Formula One management game that's coming out in a couple of months. And it reminded me of one of my favourite games ever, which is Motorsport Manager, which came out. I don't know, four, six years ago? I don't know how long ago. Uh, loved that game, so I thought I might just try and do some of those videos on the channel and, uh, and just give it a go, see if it attracts some new people uh, and see if you enjoy it. I've not decided whether to buy the Formula 1 management game. I want to see a bit more about how it looks. Uh, I 
a more sort of ride up people give it. Uh, although I might want to go in for the early access. He's not under a second yet, so we won't let him pass just yet. One minute, 15.859. Alright, oh, that caused me to overshot that. There's a bit of gap between all these, so I don't mind letting them pass. Those might not help us catch the 12. Twelve is now seven seconds ahead, so it's not much quicker than us, I think. Maybe he's uh, a bit more consistent than us. I think the nine we might have raced before in the past, recognise his name. So coming up for halfway, aren't we? Take a tear off. There you go, so this proves it is more me than the tyres, I think. We're about even on the delta. Did feel a bit loose through that those corners. So much better through that. Through all these uh, chicanes. Maybe chicanes are my weaknesses. But this track is exposing it very well. Ah, well, that's good to know. Well, Also, he's not too far behind Happiness again. But if he's pitting and he thinks he can take a set of softs to the end. Which is more than halfway. We're going to go a bit further than that because I don't feel confident in my ability to go. More than halfway on the sauce. I think the other thing we have to factor in about the 12 is he is in the hards, and the 12 is in now. So we're going to get an inflated position here. Right, I've got another car behind us. It's 
point nine. I wouldn't say he's quite close enough just yet. We'll let him through here. So what I haven't done is set up The other plans I have uh, coming up, as you probably haven't noticed, uh, well you probably have noticed, I mean, I'm a B license and I've never gone for an A license, as in I've never driven in a B license series. Well, I think I did one Indy car race, but that was on an oval, so it doesn't really count, does it? Trying to get your road race license and A by driving on an oval. Uh, 12 was only 13 seconds behind us. Let's see if he gains on us. That's a bit of a lock up. Uh, he's gone on to softs. So I don't think we'll be getting being the 12. Not unless he's incredibly bad on the sauce. So we're in 12th at the moment, but really we're 13th. The tyres do feel like they've gone off a little bit now. I know in the past I have pushed in a bit too far. Well, the last round in Bathurst, probably a, a case of me pushing the medium tyres a bit too much. But really, I don't want to be doing a softs. Just yet. And if Osman is doing a two stop, it just in case he is, well, I think we should definitely do a one stop. Right, the 13 pass is now 16 seconds ahead of us. Right, the next two are, are actually battling. Try and get let them through on the next straight.
Ah, the 12's caught out massively because of that. We've got DRS. I can't believe I don't have DRS again. One minute, six days I thought it was a double zone, but obviously not. So the leader is going to catch us. So we have to remember, we are at least doing two laps less than the full race distance. Uh, could easily be three, maybe four as well, because the leader is pit. Oh no no no! Oh no! Well, we're pitting this lap. Yeah. That's me pushing the tires again. Right, it's only five seconds. Don't know if it would be enough to hold on to. Move it, move it. On to 13th base. At least it gets the leaders behind passes right we're trying to take these to the end now that was clearly another mistake from me just from locking up He's too far behind at this point in time. That pass. I just need to find someone, a leader, who he's only slightly quicker than me. I don't think that's going to be the case. I don't know why I don't have. Uh, the RS, but anyway. 
1 minute 16.578. About to be that by 10th and 11th, so I think I'm, I'm going to be relying on incidents. The six is uh, a good enough distance behind. Seventeen seconds we'll try and keep it at that. One minute fourteen point seven seven five. Need to do better at the hairpin. So Jason, the 14, we, I think I said this earlier, we've raced him a few times. Uh, but I think that was, he was in our, last time was in our IndyCar series race at Road America. We started behind him. We might have been quite even with him in that race. So maybe my ability in the Indy car is better than the Formula 1 car. Or it's just this circuit. Hopefully fatigue will start hitting soon for some people. Oh, this is going to be good. It's going to be our fastest lap of the race so far. One minute fourteen point six four seven. Sorry this is not the most entertaining race uh, for you to watch, but I'm enjoying it. Jason's not battling the 13, so hopefully he won't be. We're extending our gap to the 6, so that's good news. One 
tear off but you never know we may find ourselves in a battle or there may be some it final lapse excitement Maybe we are about the same pace for Jason. He's struggling to catch us. He's on the hard side. So if he was on the sus, he probably wouldn't be. It does feel easier to drive now, the car. Change of tyres has helped. Lighter load as well. This is the light. Obviously, the lightest I've driven it around. Yeah, apart from qualifying in our first attempt. So, I think we have to learn from that. When I feel like the tyres are going pit try not to extend it yeah, because we have paid the price for that too many times oh, Osman is uh, back on our relative I don't think we'll be gaining 22 seconds though You would need to make a mistake. One minute, fourteen point eight seven seven. Oh, I got loose on the curb there, front left on the curb. Was it the third time we thought might have been on a two-stopper? It looks like he's pitted again, so he is. I think he will come out in front of us because we made an error. Osman's actually increasing his gap again. So, come out for 20 laps to go. Well, it probably isn't. We probably had that, given we're two laps down. One 
I don't know why around that corner frames die. I shouldn't really talk about frames dropping because you don't see the amount of frames I see because I only record 60 frames per second so you probably don't see that. Jason disappeared from behind us, is it because he's let, he's been lapped I think, he's let some lappers, some front runners through, I'm the lapper. <laughs> maybe, I don't know, maybe he's made a mistake, see oh he's pitted again, he'll still come out in front of us and this. He's pitted to get damage repaired. One minute, fifteen point two zero six. Oh, they do it. As we see in these races, there's always one guy who is super quicker than everyone else, no matter what strength of field <laughs> I race in. Sometimes there's a group of them. But most of the time, yeah, I don't know if that was the tyres losing it or me just getting a bit too aggressive. We still got the six behind us, so I don't think we can pit. Let's. Unless we see him pitting. Yeah, I think Jason did pit, but he seemed, well he definitely pitted, but seems to be in the same position. There's no one in the pits at the moment. Might have been a safety one stop. Or he did do something like we did. I need a new front wing or something. We're about a similar place to the 12, not quicker than him though. saying sorry now but well, I may just be apologising for her shouting about blue flags too much he's not in the top three 
Close to the wall. So we'll be getting a blue flag for the nine soon. Oh, I feel like, it sounded like I turned up to eight a bit too quickly there. Was close. I think I was panicking because the leader was behind me. Got a DRS though, so we use that. I had it a second time. I wonder if anyone's hit it in the War of Champions in this race. That is a brilliant story, I think. How all those champions have hit that wall. Uh, I think uh, one of my favourite, probably most people's favourite Canadian Grand Prix must be that time, Jensen Button came from the back to win in that wet drying race ah the 10 is in the pits from ninth place one minute fifteen point zero one two I don't know if I was a lap down to him or not We didn't do was check the percentage of the tyres. There we go. Oh, not as bad as I thought. Maybe the rubber in track helps. It does seem though when I get down to this like 70%. That is when I find it difficult. Ten is still in the pits, so obviously an incident has occurred. Maybe he's taken a toe. Does this lift us to twelfth? Well, no, he's still in ninth, so 
He was obviously two laps ahead of us. For some reason my sound has just got a bit quieter. But I've got a bit excited that I may be getting a position. If I can bring this home, I think I'll be happy because uh, probably our little mistake didn't cost us any position. We we're probably always going to finish in this position. Uh, he's now saying he's a lap down to me, is that true? One minute, 15.233. Yes, we are taking that position and I almost drive off again looking at the relative. Getting too excited. Fourth place is not too far away from lapping us. I think I'm not turning the wheel enough in that hairpin. It looks like we might be putting a lap on the 10, so this is all good news. Tough for him to lose it so close to the end. Frames are starting to struggle a bit. Well, that fourth place through here. Oh, was that prediction code? Did they hit the wall? DRS, we'll take it. The nice 15 seconds back to fifth place, that's good. One minute, 15.418. Got 10 left to go. I think it's less than that. Amount of times I've been lapped. I haven't felt any of that twitchiness from the tyres, so I think we can take them to the end. Which shows maybe we could have pitted sooner. In going for my A license, I haven't decided yet what ones what races I'll do, because I've got options, you know. I think I could qualify for the sprint series, or the normal series in this car, because uh, I'm over a four and the safety rating will be licensed. Oh, that was a bit kind of fine. 
Uh, or I could do some indie car races. I think I'll just go by what I fancy doing. Would be good to do some shorter races in this car, I think. Trying to improve my ability, my confidence. Feel more comfortable with the tyres and how long they'll last. Might also help me at weekends where I'm not familiar with the track. Uh, I might be purchasing Silverstone so I can run it. Ah, oh, the 12 is in the pits. Now is that planned? He could decide he could be taking a free stop so he can easily get home. Yeah, he's coming out, it is planned. He might have seen the gap was strong enough to take a free stop and not risk it. He's still come out six seconds ahead of us. I am suffering more with frames over my lap, lap not laptop, my computer's overheating. I don't know how much we want to push it. Four seconds now. Maybe he is damaged. This could be interesting. Seems like he's got up to pace. Might just be taking it easy on cold tyres. See, so in that situation, in my mind, I, I'd probably be inclined just to stay out, uh, knowing how badly my pit stops can go. I'm uh, more likely to make an error of taking a pit stop. That, well, that's how my mind works. That might not be true. Uh, well, he's holding us at 4.5 seconds, and I'm going quicker this lap. Gutted if we find out. Whoa. Well, I think that answers the question. I took a look at my relative. This is what happens when I try to push it and race with people. <laughs> look at my relative. Not got my wheel straight. I was about to say I'd be gutted if we find out. Five laps of fuel left. One minute, 15.816. Should have enough. But interesting though, my calculation probably would have taken us borderline. At the, we'd be doing full laps. Yeah, I will be gutted if he's made a mistake. God, I thought he was going to hit the wall then. Was he not happy with me, I think? I don't know why I had 
DRS activated. Uh, not activated, but available. Locking up there. Oh, I'm feeling really tired now. And hot. The penultimate lap should be getting white flag this time. Osman is like really going for it. I don't know if he thinks there's a, a bonus point for first is that. Uh, someone else behind me. We're laying bars because I. You've probably got DRS. We're not racing anyone. We haven't raced the whole race, but. Just need to bring this home now. It's been a good race. I'm actually going to finish one of these without making a mistake. Well. I did make a mistake, but it hasn't cost us a position. Maybe we had a small opportunity to get 11th position. Uh, but this is what I wanted to happen from the first... Uh, race that we tried I would have taken this but it does show at this uh, strength of field a 2k strength of field we are out of our depth and uh, the strategy we have to play is just to make sure we finish and we take up all the scraps although the Friday slot people are I don't know what's the word. Not as good, let's say, for their eye rating. Well, there's a stronger mix of. Uh... Oh, I'm happy though, Jim. I don't know why you're happy. Unhappy. There we go. Yeah. Oh, so happy with that. We found. Finished. We found. We finished a race this week. <laughs> Uh, no, we did. We did do another in the USF 2000. We did finish a race, and I got zero X as well. So that's something to be happy about. So that safety rating will be going back up, hopefully to a 4.9. Uh, we'll see you later. Oh dear, I just, uh, well, let's get the wrecks up. There's not really. There wasn't any action. Probably the most boring F1 race of the season so far for us. Uh, we didn't even have a, a try at the start. So I'll just take a drink before we show you the Rex. Oh, very difficult to take a drink uh, during the race. Uh, let's move this down. So what I was saying uh, earlier about maybe doing some motorboats motorsport manager i mean i love the strategy side you might have, of racing and the politics and ins out and that's what's really good in that motorsport manager game um uh, yeah so hopefully i can get one done soon and send it out to you uh, or it might take a while right uh let's have a look at the wrecks so it's probably a lot in the first lap. So here we go. The nine. Oh, not a wreck though, but that's well avoided. Uh, I forgot. Let me hide the overlays for you. There you go. So you don't get to see it better. All right. See, there's an, is there another one? Sixteen. Just too much throttle. Gets away with that. 
Don't remember seeing his name though. 18. Oh yeah, we saw him just go straight on. Didn't even... Boy, he did try and make the corner, but I think he gave up a bit too easy. Oh, no, he didn't. He was going to miss it. But there we go. Well, maybe I can count that as an overtake. <laughs> oh. Oh, this is the one. Oh, the one into the World Champions. But that was prediction code. Yeah, I was going back to see that was it. 19. At the hairpin, just locks up a bit and then spins it. Hey, we didn't do that. That's a tricky bit of spot the gal. Ah, he's managed to do it. Ah. I don't know why it likes going back. 25. Oh, I did that in practice, but not in the race, thankfully. Too much throttle, and he has damaged his car there. Did we? Oh, crumbs. This is. I mean, at least he's got out of a dangerous position, but. 20. Overshots. Locks it up. Spins. Oh, almost an incident there, but not quite. Four. Four champions, and that's. Not prediction code, or is it? No, the front is still broken. So that's the yeah. end. Yeah, it sounds completely broken. No, you can't turn. Like, we can. Oh, don't know what's going on there. Uh, 23. Oh, scrapes the wall with champions. He's in a battle by the sounds of it. Is that an overtake? 25. Oh, too much throttle. Nice save, though. Difficult spot to get off. He looks like he's got some damage on the rear end there. So something else has happened. Just wait for that person to go. 23. Sounds like there's a car on the inside. They're going to come together. Oh, he pushes wide. Oh, oh, and then he hit. And into the barrier. Oh, is this, this is the one he... What lap is that? Uh, might use that as a thumbnail. Lap 10. <laughs> so he's, that was probably the scariest moment of the race for us. 25 again. Oh, he's not going to get away with it this time, though. Yeah, that curb is deadly. 23 again. Oh, getting it all sorts of wrong. Into gravel trap. I don't know where he's going now. He's probably getting frustrated. Oh, too much accelerator. Just calm down. Three. Locks up a bit there. Oh, it hits the back. That's the guy. The 18, yeah. That uh, we saw going straight on. Oh, uh, World Champions, is that real damage? No, prediction code. Looked like it should have been real. 15. Is this a battle? Oh! Yeah, that cost them what? That, I mean, uh, sorry, I'm going to have to just kill an overlay so I can see. So he was in third. So was this actually for position? No, it wasn't. You're wanting to get past uh, a bat marker. That's what happened to Steve. Oh! And 22. I don't know why he's still. Oh, this is all sorts of all sorts of mess. Oh yeah, 20. And it, oh, crumbs. <laughs> Ninety just sits there. Yeah, just quit. The way it goes back to me. It's still. S oh, I think. He's still sitting there. There we go. He's gone. Whew. So the next one is the eight. Oh. Yeah. Those tyres lacking a bit of grip. He hits the outside wall there. 
Although we did that. The five. It's forgotten about turn one. Takes the shortcut. Worth remembering. The one here. Oh, this time the one is out. Now, is this a battle? He's in seventh. It's a, it's a, a guy in 22nd again. Oscar, Oscar, why are you not lifting off there? Just let him have the line. That's pretty poor driving there. Lap down. Nice save though. So that's not what... Oh! Oh, don't tell me that is what cost him. <laughs> So that was for position. Uh, let's see it from the nine's point of view. It's the nine, isn't it? No, the eleven's point of view. Sorry. He's out wide. Oh, they just hit in the same bit of the track, and that ends the one's race. I think the steering is all out. He's not going to be able to. Oh, he's going to be able to turn it. No, he's not. He's going to quit. What next? The 23? Oh, that one hurts. Yeah. 22. Curb War Champions. I think if you hand locked up, you might have got away with that one. But I don't really know what I'm talking about. The 20. Is this a battle? No, is that an impasse? Oh. That was prediction code, but I think it's actually sent him into the barrier. Is it going to... No, it's all prediction code. I don't know. Is he broken there? Yeah, yeah, he is. He's crabbing a bit. Oh, that's a bit harsh. 16. Oh, too much curb. That's a big one as well. 26. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah. Is he broken? Yeah. Three. You can see there's a bit of net code is lagging a bit. Don't know why it's showing that, but maybe that's the net code. 15, he's back out. Oh, he puts on the grass into the wall. Too hard. 13, I don't know what's going on here. Oh, who was that? The 11 just gets it all wrong. Too wide. He has a pug on the apex, and that finished his, his day, and I'm sure the 13's damage. See here if the two... I mean, he might be lapping him there, actually. Oh, the 9 into the back of the car in front. Spins. But gets it back going again. Six. Yeah, we've seen others do that. No, it's only front wing damage. So he's got away with that. 14. Is this what happened to Jason? No, it's just a lock up. The 3? What lap are we on now? 35. Okay, that's alright. We're halfway. Should get less than. Yeah, it looks like those tyres are a bit warm, maybe. The 5. Oh, that's aggressive. Oh, prediction code hit on the war champions the seven I don't know why it's showing up me overshot lock it up <laughs> that's so pathetic <laughs> oh look at that front wing at least I only cost them a front wing this time didn't even get an X for it uh, well wall hits a zero X aren't they 
10. I don't know why it's showing that. 14. Is this what Jason does? I mean, it actually might have been strategy. Nah, he's fine. The 8. Yep, revving out too much. We almost did that. Doesn't leave too much time. The 9. Ah, oh, he's... Ooh. Prediction code here. The War of the Champions. I remember the original. I was watching when Michael Schumacher did that. Uh, I think he was the first one. 24. Don't know what's going on here. Just seen the, haven't seen the 24, I don't think. The 9 again. Is this going to be prediction code? Yeah, it was very close though. Fought it. Hang on, was he off? No, he's not. It's just the dirt on the track. Oh, he loses it. So that is maybe... Where is that? That 55. That might have been what happened. He lost time and he decided to pit for new tyres. The 10. Oh, this looks very cumbersome. Whoa! <laughs> That's a massive overreaction. Overreaction on the netcode. That... <laughs> Oh, he's got to feel bad about that. So, but, you know, we gained a position from that. So, you know, if he wants to feel good, he gave me a position today. Thank you, Adam. The 24. There's still more even after that. Oh, I don't know why it's showing that. The 2. Oh, it's a bit lagging, isn't it? Laggy on the internet. I think that's it. Hey, we got to the end of that. Uh, so let's let me try and get the results up for you. Uh, why am I selecting that? Here it is. Here are the results. So it was a two zero eight three strength of field. We gained twenty three I rating. It's a fraction of what we've lost this week. It does take us back to a, a 1.8 not quite a 4.99 but I mean we had lot, lost a lot of safety rating so that, that's good to be back to a 4.81 uh, we were car number 17 we started down in 23rd and we finished 12th happy with that 72 championship points that's about, about the average for us really so I'm happy with that uh, certainly worth rerunning. Uh, top UK and I driver, not top Division Three, but anyway, in terms of pace, we did one fourteen point three, so it was nice to be in the low fourteens. But you see, everyone ahead of us was quicker. Even Usman did it over a second quicker than that. Uh, at least we were quicker than the six. We found someone that we were quicker than. Uh, Oh, we're quicker than the 11 as well. That's good. Anyone else? 26, although we're getting to the realms of people who have not done many laps. Quicker than 26. Quicker than the 20. I mean, yeah, let me keep going back. 23. So we're, we're quicker than a few people. Uh, than the rest, you know. How they didn't do many laps today. Uh... In terms, well done to the two for winning, but in terms of the biggest I rating gained, it's the 21. And I managed to get a fourth place, so, so well done to Benny, that's a fantastic result. And I rating loss, it's got to be the four down here. Uh, I was 26 laps down, but lost 138 I rating, ouch. Thank you very much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed this one, and I'll uh, see you again soon. Goodbye.